Hi everyone, this is Jennifer Beamer, owner-operator of Expertly Diet Art by Science, and today I have a drop spindle, which means I'm going to teach you guys how to spin. <laughs> and this is actually really fun, um, despite how boring and tedious it may look at first. I thought it was really crazy. I saw women doing this at like those heritage museums. <laughs> And I thought, well, I'm never going to do that. And then I started knitting in 2005, and I'm like, I'm never going to make my own yarn. There's no way. And then I started making my own yarn, and I was completely enthralled. I was hooked, so to speak. Anyway, so I will, I will talk about this in the next video. This video is going to be really short. All I wanted to do was talk about three main ways a fiber is prepared. And... Um, a little bit about how you can look at the fiber and know what you're getting and if it's if it's convenient enough um, people will actually list it as such they'll tell you what it is and if not you can always ask and then know what um, to expect once you get it anyway so the most common type is this this is a big old bag of fiber that I brought with me from America and this is um, basically top. So it comes in this big piece like this, right? It's really fat and oftentimes this will be dyed in beautiful colors and then like they'll wrap it in a really nice way so that when you get it it looks like a braid, right? It's like all just put together like this. It's really pretty and um, this, is, this preparation what they do is at the commercial mill usually they'll take the fibers and they'll uh, comb out the short fibers and do that do something else with that and then they'll keep the long fibers left over and then after they comb it they put it through a machine that makes the fibers like exactly parallel to each other so when you spin with this you're going to get a really strong not fluffy yarn um, which is useful for a lot of reasons. So um, yeah, so this is the first the first way that a lot of knitters or sorry, a lot of spinners will start spinning is with combed top. Um, and then <clears throat> the second way fiber is often prepared. This is a lovely, oh, super sheepy um, roving. So what they did is they left the short pieces in and they combed it all together so or carded it all together so there's short pieces and long pieces and there's like little nubby pieces in here as well and this actually isn't as wide it's actually very thin and um, they put this through a very similar machine to lay it roughly parallel but it's not going to be exactly parallel even if you were to spin this uh, worsted weight so um, when you're when you're drawing the fibers are going to be going in like this instead of like this uh, into your yarn um, so you're, you're still gonna get a little bit more of a dense yarn with this but that don't let that scare you because <laughs> the yarns for all of these types can be very soft and lofty it just depends on how you actually do your spinning so um, this is the second way um, fiber is prepared roving and then the last I'm so excited to show you this before I left the United States, I had a little extra money in my budget, so I decided to go all out and buy cashmere. Oh, this stuff is so wonderful. <laughs> it's like the most luxurious cotton candy in the world, right? And this is called a cloud. So the fibers are going every which way in this particular fiber. And I, I don't know if you could really see how like when I fan this out a little bit you can see how the fibers are just kind of doing their own thing um, this is the third most common preparation of fiber and this is really nice because you can just kind of pull from wherever and spin as you go and this will actually be a lighter softer yarn than the others besides the fact that this is cashmere and the reason is um, the fibers growing every which way so when you're spinning they kind of stick out a little bit and it, it adds some loft um, so like it does it's not easily compressed is, is what I'm trying to say so this is this is the cloud 
Oh gosh. Oh, this stuff is so gorgeous. <laughs> Excuse me while I have my fiber orgasm here. <laughs> anyway, so um, <clears throat> these are the uh, three three main. Um, I do that a lot. <laughs> The three main, the three main fiber preparations that um, are pretty common in uh, the fiber stores and stuff like that. So, combed top, roving, and cloud. All right, stay tuned because drop spoodle time is coming. Yay!